Hello everyone. We're going to be talking about how to fix the undo problem. Basically what happens is you will try to use control or command Z and when you try to do it either nothing happens or random stuff happens that you didn't previously do in the past. I'm going to unhide these. We'll do okay, we'll do the upper arm. We'll do it in a different order order this time. Diff upper arm with that. And then I'm going to do this auto rig. Okay, so I didn't want that to happen. So I'm going to try to undo it. And nothing happens. Okay, so this is what happens. So you keep pressing it, pressing it, pressing it. Nothing happens. You go to edit and you go to history. And then you have this. If you're running into this, um, you have a serious problem that needs to be resolved. Here's the solution. The solution is not using this plugin, which is called Motion Factory. Uh, Motion Factory has an issue where if you use the plugin in After Effects, it basically allows your undo button to malfunction, I should say. So like if you use this plugin for any purposes, your undo button will malfunction. So here's the solution. The first thing I would do is delete Motion Factory. You want to go to your C drive. Then you want to go to Program Files X86 if you're using a 64-bit uh, machine. If you're using a 32-bit, then it will just be Program Files. Then you want to go to Common Files, Adobe, CEP, Extensions. And then find the Pick Flow extension or Pick Flow library. I've already deleted it but it'll be a folder. You want to delete the entire folder. And you'll see I have Red Giant, Adobe, and then I have like RTFX and Explainer Pack. Those are extensions. So those are going to apply to all of the After Effects and Premiere programs. So that's why you would want to come here to uninstall it. For some reason, Motion Factory doesn't have anything in their website on how to delete their stuff because they don't want you to. I get it. So that is it. I hope you enjoy this solution. I hope it works. If you have any questions, please leave that in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. And most importantly, if you're looking for an animation to be made, hit us up. We'll make it for you. Take care.